Why does that sound like a sickness I cannot cure? And somewhere there is a place where all of my yesterdays have escaped to. And with his hands slipping up my thighs, tears streaming, he says I make writing poetry easy. I think I am the sound of cannons. Or the eyes of someone that has realized the light is fading. He says my curves remind him of the ocean. But all I hear is that loving me almost feels like drowning. I think seeing the worst of myself is hereditary. That, that, that I am more like my mother than I ever care to admit. Some days dying is the easiest thing I never did. And some days I'm just swallowing the knives in my mouth. And my mother often reminds me that love is not worth dying for. She repeats it like a mantra while she's dry heaving into the toilet. I wonder if we are all just women of wounds. Some days I am floating between the pavement and the sky. It is on these days that I am the heaviest. I want to go back to somewhere far back in time to a place where the pomegranates did not taste like death. And childhood was not a trauma we needed to dissect. It is on these days that I am weightless, floating. Maybe that is why I do not have it in me to come and say goodbye or to say forgive me. Somewhere we are still children, baptizing ourselves in the rain, thinking it was holy water. Who knew? All it would take were the wandering hands of a man to make us realize it was just acid rain and that we are melting into something unrecognizable. Some place in the not so far corners of that burning building we ventured into as kids, there lay all our un untold truths awaiting us. But I am not there yet. And sometimes forgiveness is a grave I slowly lower myself into. And somewhere I am throwing myself off the highway that leads me home. And sometimes the haunting will morph itself into an orchestra of symphony symphonies that I hope I am around long enough to learn to dance to.